Association for Public Art asked me to create a piece that would reflect all the institutions along the Benjamin Franklin Parkway. Three art museums, two science museums, an art school, a library, two churches, a horticultural society. Benjamin Franklin is, is probably in every single collection. And I realized that he touches every aspect of culture. The piece was inspired by the scientific research of Benjamin Franklin. He discovered that lightning and uh, static electricity were actually the same thing, and I decided to consider how uh, electricity is formed in clouds. And I found out that small particles of ice kind of uh, collide into each other up in the clouds and form static electricity, which becomes lightning. I think because it's light and it's animated and moving, people kind of stop and wonder. Now when you go home, get a piece of ice and look at it, and you'll see that it's like this, the surface. And it looks somewhat celestial too, all those like little asteroids. It's kind of meditative though too, I like, yeah, I mean, you I can like get how... Lost. You can get lost in it. When we came out of the Franklin Institute, it just jumped right out at us. So first I took a picture from across the street, and then we said, well, we have to go, we have to come closer. We never got close to them, though. We always see them from the street. It's so cool, and I like how the flowers come once in a while. It is so unique. I mm -hmm. mean, they, I have never seen something like it. Mm -hmm. Kind of amazing to be put into a situation where I'm thinking about art in relation to science and culture in general. In this piece, um, the particles, I decided to make them sort of hand-drawn. There's little sketches and things on them, so it's kind of like a mysteriously these cave paintings kind of showed up on these particles which are kind of crashing into each other. And so it begs the question, I guess, who drew these? It's my way of saying, well, maybe life isn't exactly a random sequence of events, that there's something perhaps behind it. It's showing you this work that is maybe made by some other sort of being or something that's intangible from, from our experience. Thank you.